Hello, I am originally from St. Louis, Missouri. I transplanted to New York a long, long time ago, and now I'm a happy transplant and resident of Monmouth County. I became interested in the arts at a very early age because of my family, but it was high school where it all just came together, largely due to my teacher, Georgia Chauffel. She changed everything and introduced me to a world where I found myself, and from that moment forth, that was it. I, I came to NYU. I was in their very sort of fledgling musical theater program at the time. Wardrobe being in and auditioning and everything, it all really came together when my apartment burned down on Christmas night of 1990. The only thing the fire did not touch was my family pictures and my audition material. To have nothing, I mean, the entire place was burnt, charred, and that fire went up and around like these pictures on the wall. It went up and around them like a finger. The results of that was clear to me. All you need is where you came from and where you're going. I just started auditioning and that was it. I didn't think about anything else. I came here to get on Broadway and that is what I'm doing. And I was starting to really get some better auditions and better opportunities. I started directing at that time. And I was directing when my uh, rent auditions happened. And uh, I'm like, oh gee, wow. I have an audition, <laughs> gotta, run, gotta run over here for this audition. Next thing you know, I'm having to choose between Brent and another show. Jonathan was actually the one who fought for me to play Joanne. How that makes me feel is indescribable. I was like, yeah, let's do something different. Downtown, it's easier commute, we'll do Rent. <laughs> and that's how that happened. The artistic lesson that I got from Rent, I actually got years before Rent. That you are permitted the truth of how you feel, regardless of what you do or say. Story is how humans communicate. And those of us who are blessed to do it for a living and to do it professionally, we have an obligation to imbue the story with all of the truth that we can. That is what I carry. That is what I, I try to live and to embody in all of my work, no matter what I'm doing. I am um, speechless, honestly, at being honored by um, Mom Farts. I like, what have I done to get the Artistic Achievement Award? It still sort of blows my mind. I am very honored to be recognized for my work in the arts and the arts community. I'm proud to be a part of the arts community. I very much support the work of the arts. Let's face it, folks, none of this gets done by money. These people are out there fighting to get y'all money. That's what this really is. And so there is nothing to say to Mom of Arts except thank you. Thank you. Thank you because we need